Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and tonight we're continuing, continuing Silent Hill 3. Uh, I think I'm gonna die at a boss one time, especially in Metal Gear Solid, watching the cutscenes when this wireless control just just turns off, which I can totally see happening. Uh, we just did one episode of Silent Hill 3. I skipped uh, last week's one or even two. Uh, and I really, 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 really want to play this game. And I really want to play Silent Hill 4 afterwards. Um, what's the last thing we did? Ooh, checking memory card. Let's see. But, oh yeah, alright. Okay. Loading completed. Uh, the PAL version of Silent Hill 3, which I'm playing, has the option to switch to 60Hz and TSC, which gives the... Which makes the game run faster and most... I, I'm not sure exactly, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not sure if it's uh, the case for uh, Silent Hill 3, like with uh, Final Fantasy and uh, Resident Evil games. I know that PAL version of Outbreak will actually kind of run faster on 60 hertz, uh, And the picture won't be, you know, uh, vertically squashed, because how hard can it be to convert it from 480 lines to 576 apparently very hard so Silent Hill 3 has a similar issue where I actually write down the values of the <laughs> uh, position and size of the game window so there wouldn't be any unnecessary black bars left right up or down and so far with this game it's a little finicky because I can't find a full screen other than in game and I think I nailed it just like prompto okay okay then this level, level, this location where we're at, we don't have the map off, but uh, it's the it's like the, an underpass or something. There's gonna be a lot of angry penises around, like a lot of angry penises. Broken. Um, messing with outbreak controls which I reset to default Japanese layout where circle is action, X is back which is the totally opposite of what we've been taught at, uh, in the West especially by Xbox and uh, now we don't want any of that now do we? hold on a moment nope and Thanks, but no. So, as I was saying, a Xbox and like modern PlayStation games are teaching us X is confirm and <laughs> Circle is back. Well, it was always like the It was the opposite even in... Oh, should I turn off the lights? On the... Woo! Oh, he still got me. And there's pendulums. Oh, God, this is not going to be good. Okay, not a good start. Let's run to the first door. We'll sort this out later. Darkness is my friend. I hear an angry penis. Oh, there's an angry penis. Look at him. Okay, let's see how well I can do this with the... Uh... Oh, my God, I missed. Go on, be faster than him. I think we both hit each other. I got to get that timing down. He's dead. That's one dead penis. Okay. Let's check this one. Yeah. Yeah, bitch. One, two, three should be enough. And then, eh. Okay, okay. Kind of saved me. Let's check the other corner. I did not. Oh, yeah. Okay, these controls also make start the. Yes, that's what I want. Why would you not keep that on with giant and small penises around? I don't know. There's another door. I still don't have the map, which is the first thing I want to get. Is this door working? Yes, it's it's a penile door. Oh, why am I not surprised? Acha, acha, acha. Another penis. One penis next to another 
Penis! Oh my god. Penis! Eh. Eh. Gotta be careful, they're jumping from behind the corners. Okay. Don't wanna read the papers? Who wants yesterday's papers? Who wants yesterday's girl? Thanks for the host, John. You the man, man. Okay. You wanna rest, Heather? Are you... Hmm. Wait. At this time, you should not be at work. Wide awake. I expected you to be asleep, honestly. Thanks for the follow, Dr. Octavius1. Appreciate it. Okay, more penises. I'm putting a penile embargo here. No more penises. Where are you looking? Towards the door? Broken. Okay, I think this is where I need to find a bottle or something. Oh, boy. A good looking. Oh, so I just went into circles. Okay. Being bad enough, after a bit, I'm gonna eat up uh, in a bit and then do dishes. As every grown ass man should. Yeah, <laughs> that's why you're the man. Uh. Professor Wesker and uh, Salty are playing uh, Outbreak, and I so wish to join them, but I have a schedule to uphold, so perhaps tomorrow? Some of you guys can join up forces with Zombie and me, and... Uh... Oh my god, it's three penises! Okay, fuck that. It's time for the shotgun. What did, what did I get it for? Oh, I think I'll have to do some drugs here. Okay. One, four, nine, sure. Uh, shoddy time. How many shells do I have? Enough. Actually, why shoddy? Shouldn't I just pistol them? Actually, yeah, this, this will get more of the... Flip around, woman, you fucking blind. Yep, it gets... Why am I standing there? Just fucking hit them. Oh, they're done. So they only did... Haha. Um... <laughs> God, these creatures, I'm sorry, I can't fucking focus, they're horrifying. Okay, now ramble. That's one dead penis. Oh, two dead penis. Heather, the penis killer. Okay, I can, I can pipe you down. So they did end of the road. Okay, timing good. Uh. Wacky wacky. Stay down, boy. Any files? I kind of remember there being a file to read here that I didn't get often. <laughs> it is. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's what I want. The map and the fucking... what What's it called? Mace. No, even worse. Mall. The bloody map. It's, a, it's an underpass map. Toolbox? You gonna comment on that? Ah, no, she's not. No, she's not. Here we go. Got a mole. Do I wanna? Oh, sh will she open it? The blood seeping out of the. There's blood seeping out of the bottom of the locker. Is there something inside? I sorta wanna take a look, but the locker locker won't open. Ah, it's better that way. It's not as if there's anything good in there. I'm gonna leave this one alone. Smart girl, because I would have made you open it, and then we'd both die. Helmets? Should I take all them with me? Nah, never mind. It's pretty geeky look. That's your concern! How the fuck do you survive? Take them with me, okay? But what are you going to do with five helmets, Heather? <laughs> Nothing particularly useful looking on the shelf. Aside from the boxes you can throw, like those wooden crates, I bet they would cause some pain. They even look like loaded with explosives. You know what? You should go to a short horror course to Travis. Because he's the horror man. Oh god, two floors of this penis infested lair. Where did they come from? There. Okay. There was nothing there. I went through that door. 
I gotta go there and fight those pendulums because I will never be able to look myself in the eye if I don't do that. Anything on the board? So yeah, I was saying, as I was saying, because I tried the Japanese out uh, layout on uh, in Outbreak and it actually works, I thought I'd never be able to use X for running and circle for confirmation. I just did that in Silent Hill 3 as well, because that's that's actually the default config. Only in the Western release it defaults to B, so this is A, and I can run with X and actually use the light on the run with the square. I don't know why we ever changed that in the West, because as I was saying, a Super Nintendo had it the uh, had it that way. It worked magnificently. We all played Super Nintendo games where the right button A would be confirmed. So what's this? This is just gonna take me to that loop where there's nothing but a. Why do I go there? Actually, did I just go there to kill some enemies for the bad ending? Because that's not my goal. Where is she looking? The door. Okay. The only door that works. Is this readable? Is there a file here to read or did I make that up? But I better hold S because I'm planning to do the entire underpass. Is that a sound of a throbbing pe- oh yeah, you can guard. I keep forgetting you can guard. And then do what? Yeah, you can guard. That's badass. Why do I forget that? You gotta time the guard. You can't just mark it and hold it. Yeah, so... Hmm. I never used the... Uh... Where were you looking? It's like there's... I have a memory of a f document being here, but I guess there's nothing. So not there, I want to go back and face my fears. I mean, there's so much phallic symbolism in this game, because she has, among other things, aversion to sex, and uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that's supposed to be a throbbing penis. I don't know, I'm just, just throwing it out there, because as a kid I didn't get a lot of that, and then... Holy shit, some, I think, yeah, it was a book of, book of lost memories that started opening my eyes. Mm, that's kind of weird. Let's try this, actually. It should kill a penis or two. So, oh god, it looks heavy. So, tab does that. Hold does. Has a, needs a more timing practice, but I should be, okay, more. Like a big round pointy hammer. It's super heavy, but at least it's got some oomph. Yeah, that's the first time I ever heard that word in Silent Hill 3, when she said oomph. Like, what the fuck is an oomph? Okay, let's try to get them while they're down. No, 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 faster, Heather. Yeah, you'll never do it with that. You know what? This is This looks like a quest for the shotgun. No, shoot it up! Are you fucking blind?! Oh god, I s this is so much worse than Tom. Get away from the big penis and everything! Oh, okay. am I down? I f uh, this feels like I'm gonna die. Not down! Oh god, I'm so... G I'm getting beaten by a fucking... And now you reload. Okay. Oh, this is not good. This is so not good. Five shells for that. It hurts me on so many levels I can't even begin to express. Oh god, she's not gonna turn, but... Did I heal? Not yet, not yet. I'm gonna kill you all, just because this is now personal. I don't probably don't have to, even, but at this point, fuck you all. Yeah, this is not working. What's my help? Looks bad. Yeah, yeah, you can handle this, Heather. You got that. It's kind of fast. Can I take a hit? If I'm gonna die, I better die in a, at the 
beginning of this then, at the end. Oh, you're making me use the shotgun against you. What's with their HP anyway? Do they regenerate? And what's up with the demonic sounds? <laughs> oh, I'm sweating. Yeah, let's try this, see what happens. Surrounded! Get up! Get the fuck up! Oh, God, 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 God. One down at least. Oh. Fuck him before he fucks you. Okay, okay, this isn't good. Let the pendulum come first. Fuck yeah! Oh, it's making me waste my shotgun. I never use shotgun here. No, kick him while he's down. Oh god. Oh, you get another one. Just for being mean. Oh, that's not. I guess health doesn't matter in this game. You just get whacked and. And that's it. That was pretty bad, but let's try to make up for it. I said it countless times. Silent Hill 3 is for me the hardest of the series. Sometimes I feel it's unfair. I'm gonna mold something. This time. Who's left here? Show yourself. Just the three of them. That's that's sad. I shouldn't have used all that. And there's nothing here. I did all that for nothing. Well, I'll remember for the next time. This was just like an ego run. <laughs> what does the map say? The map says, you dipshit, why did you come here? And I say, I wanted items. So there's not even, nothing even there or there. Just so many enemies you don't even have to fight. And I fought them all. It's not even funny. The, the hard part's coming soon. Okay. Should be okay now. I'm actually thinking of reloading that save. Just because there was an necessary. I didn't pick up a single thing. I shouldn't have killed anyone. And I wasted a lot of health. Yep. Let's just restart this. Uh, how do we do that? We hold select and start, I think. Yep. And then instead of continue, we'll go to load. And just do this as we should. So, uh... Better. A lot better. No, so there's no, uh, no body armor yet. At least I know where to go and what to do now. Turn off the lights and just... Avoid the penile threat. <laughs> I heathered the penis killer. Are we gonna make... Oh, yeah. Let's run in the dark. Ignore it. Just touch it. Because you're a fucking OCD sufferer. And you can't go without... Should be okay in the dark. Okay, this is a whole other story. Alright, that's how you do it. Oh, they're still there. Okay, never mind. Okay, Heather the penis killer. Let's see. Nice timing me. Uh, three wax in the head and the penis goes... Hello, sir. Whackapy. Sounds like I'm hearing those uh, pendulums. But yeah, I don't have the map of this area. How silly of me. Actually, what's gonna be if I enter here? Rest. Rest. Oh yeah, and put on the Bulletproof vest. That was a lot better. That's how you do it. You don't go... But you don't know that the first time you're playing, right? 
or if you haven't played in a long time so it's not easy a hip and a scup and a step and a whack Oh, nice dodge, Mr. Penile. Haha, <laughs> look at him dodge. You can't dodge forever. Eh. So there's nothing here. It's just my imagination. Hello, zombie. Nice to see you. Sorry, I'm just looking around. I, I got mauled by penises and pendulums, so I decided to just reload the save, and it went a lot better. You don't have to fight half of them. Not not even half of them. You don't have to fight... Wait, there was three of them here before. What the hell? Yeah, I know, man. I was just looking, I think... So I was checking out uh, Professor Wesker's and uh, Salty's streams, and I realized that on prefer, prefer, uh, Professor Wesker's stream, you can you can actually choose the uh, the bitrate and all that. So I think that's like a subscription thing. And I'm planning to subscribe on Twitch Pro or whatever it's called. Oh, this is the place of the three pieces. The triple penile threat. The big one. Actually, can they... Should I attempt to just whack him? You know what? I will. Ah, oh, I missed. Ah, oh, but I hit again. You're slow, Mr. PP. I'm gonna call you PP. So yeah, I think uh, that's why you can't uh, choose on my stream. It's just whatever I'm streaming at. Which is whack, but I get it. I get why they do that. Oh, there's two of them. Can I... Will this be... You know what? This is a good... This is a good spot for my friend, the pistol. Hello, the pistol. Ah, oh, why are you alive? I shot you dead. Jesus, cheater. Cheater, cheater, penis eater. Yeah, I've said penis too many times in this stream, but... That's what they are. That's literally what they are. So what was it? Here first? Yes. Okay, let's get the map. An underpass map. Wait, is there more of them? I got them all. Oh yeah. If I remember correctly, um, the mall is fast, uh, is uh, stronger and all that, but its speed and different timing can be a problem. Takes a while to whack. Hold it, and, and she will get tired easily. But I should try it. Okay, we've seen that. And helmets, we've seen that. And this, we've seen that. She just doesn't want to throw him. So what does the map say now? Now... Huh. Let's try that. This place has been deep penisized. Yeah, it's broken. Okay. If I go back there at the beginning, just to satisfy my OCD, just to check that uh, that it's closed. Yeah, I'm, I'm willing to sacrifice health for this way more than for <laughs> missed timing. So, uh, where was it again? It was to the left of me. Turn out the lights. Turn out the lights. Prepare a pipe. They should have subsided by now. D 
Did you remember their positions game? Did, did they not move from there at all? Ah, okay, they can't see well in the dark, so that part's good, yeah. Okay, okay. Was it worth it? It was. I have a red line on my map now. Of course it was worth it. Now I can leave, live and die peacefully. Ah, yeah. Okay, let's press on. What's next? Another hallway of penises. Oh, God. That's a big one. Now, if I do this right, I should be able to whack it with a mole. If I don't do this right, it will whack me with it. Just gotta get that timing right. Ah, he can whack too. Huh, listen to me, a penis can whack. <laughs> okay, shoot it down a bit. That saved a few bullets, I'm sure. That was better than I expected. I managed to whack, whack it with a, with a mole. Ah, <laughs> whack a mole. <laughs> Kick that penis. Uh, kick that other things, just to make sure. Step on that. No, don't turn the camera now. Are you fucking seen? Faster than him? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, this is not good for them. But they do miss because of the animation. Still three hits. Yeah, you know what? Stick to the pipe. It's faster and not as... As weaker as it seems. Where do we go now? Oh, this is the wine, and that's is that the document? No, there's no document. Apparently, I just made it up somehow. But yeah, wine in a place like this. Well, I suppose. Uh, well, I suppose it is dark and dry. Only one of the bottles is empty. And that's the one she took. <laughs> the body must have been crushed by something heavy. Your body? With what then? God, how awful. What body? Beef jerky. She got some beef jerky. Is that a is that an error or am I not seeing anything? No, she doesn't want to look around this place. I think this is a... I don't see a body there. I think this is a... This is an error because this should have been in the subway where you find a dead man. Dead man, dead man, swinging in a tree. How many dead men do you see? Come on, Heather, sing. Sing, Heather, sing. Uh, wheelbarrow. No, no comments on wheelbarrow or this, Heather. You disappoint me. There's nothing interesting. You're nothing interesting. Oh Jesus, it's a penisorama! Stay away! I got a pipe! I know it's your biggest weakness. Yeah! Is the big one back? I hope not. No, these are the new ones. Okay. Are they blind? Dark? Okay, I should be able to whack one of them while the other one... Two... Three... And then get the other one. Ah, that was bad. I tried something and it failed. The body of the other one literally cog blocked me. <laughs> eh. Okay, still better than the last time. Just needed the refresh. Okay, music, chill out. They're dead. Jesus, fuck. Just stop it. Thank you. Well, at least someone's listening to me. Um. The cardboard box doesn't have anything useful in it. Ooh. But the barrel does. Oh, it's like walled. Can I break this? Eh. Nope. Okay. Hmm. 
now, from here we go right, this is pretty much like linear and straightforward. Just if you want to explore, you can do what I'm doing. If not, you can, people just speed through this easily. Oh god, these textures are too good for their time. Hear that? Peeny peeny. Weenies. I'm gonna call them weenies. Yeah, that's more like, like, oh, it's so dirty. Oh, not these guys. Fuck those guys and whoever brought them into the game. Jesus. No. I decline your offer. Pistol? Hmm. Will they eat? You know what? I'm gonna use one and see what happens. Will you go for the jerky? That looks like a pendulum. They're fast. They're mean. I've never found a good strategy for them. Now, where did I put that jerky? Ah! Okay, it's not this far. I'm expecting them to just stop and eat, but... You can't aim for shit, Heather. Shotgun. No, nothing else with these guys but shotgun. This is just a waste of bullets every goddamn time. Five bullets, two hit. Just shotgun in the face and... Let... Some I'll sort them out. Fuck you. Seriously? Fucking seriously? Just stop hardest enemies in the series. Yet the other one, there was two shells. Get him. He's gonna get up. If I whack him fast enough. Okay, they don't like the pipe. Yeah, I'm pretty hurt. They don't give a shit about the pipe. Kick him, kick him while he's down. Oh. Something else there. Another one. Seemed a lot harder with the shotgun. Hoo wee! Thank you for dropping by, John. Thanks for the host and all the support. I really appreciate it. It's nice to have a community of people, like-minded individuals, who uh, who support you sitting around and playing a game. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, she can fall fall into holes on normal, so I'm not even gonna play with that, but on hard she she's just like the whole sucker and on normal mm, not so much, but okay. That would be the first health item to use and uh oh, supplies. Supplies, motherfucker. Uh four of those and nine of those. Hello Gavin, nice to see you. Glad you could drop by. Welcome to Silent Hill 3, where we got beef jerky and health drinks. Hmm. Oh, I'm so frugal with these health items. You know what? For now, for now, I'm gonna use one of these, yeah, just like easier pain. And then later I'm gonna use a med kit, a full-on med kit. So there's nothing interesting here. Lights off, door open. Oh wow, okay, that looks like a layer of wee-wees. Why can't I take that pipe? It looks like better than my pipe. More newspapers, she won't read. <laughs> uh it really make me made me happy when John asked if zombies around to join us in Outbreak. That was... Uh, I like how we're all connecting. 
I let my zombies become famous and wanted. I might have to schedule a I might have to schedule in his diary for the future when I want him in my streams. People are gonna start. Okay, I'm just gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Sounded like a dying giraffe. You know, from South Park, when they, uh, from the movie, when they say, uh, we'll meet at the signal of the dying giraffe or whatever. What, what's the sound of the dying giraffe? <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Something like this. But yeah, I was saying, um, the way it's going, I might have to, like, rent a zombie for a stream. Very broken. Is someone else here with me? Is that supposed to be? Okay, yeah. We're, um... Gotta go there first. I think. Yes. Before I go... Can I even go north? Yeah, north is gonna go up. Oh god, I can't remember. Let's go back first. I know I have to find the hair dryer. Because, why not? Just get the... Vest off, so I can run like a person. Oh god, that's so much better. I remember playing this on easy just so I wouldn't have to keep the vest on and get destroyed. Oh wait, that doesn't even... Does not compute. So, uh, yeah, there's nothing else left, just these two rooms. No files. But the way she rests when she's tired, what is that? What is this? I've been piping the penises all the day, all the work day long. I've been piping down the penises. As I'm singing this song. Boom, boom. Eeny? Oh, that's a big one. That's a humongous, jamongous. That's not a penis. That's a cock. <laughs> um, no, I'm gonna try to do at least one stream a week with my resistance friends. Okay, that guy looks like he's gonna whack me hard. Oh! Just the sounds they're letting out. Hi. Eh. Okay. I thought there's two of them. Jeez. So yeah, I'm gonna try to do at least one a week with my uh, resistance uh, friends. Mutation, whom I played uh, Sea of Thieves with before. Um, la last night. We become. We actually met uh, in Resistance, and we become. I'm gonna say close friends. Uh, we just we clicked, I guess. I do. I do. I'm not gonna say hold it against him, but something in a in a lighter sense that he doesn't want to play Outbreak with us because he played it on the OG servers, and he just uh, he has memories and all that that he doesn't want to tarnish. I'm gonna say, but. Um, he's. I can kind of be grateful to him for. Um, he was a big factor in me starting a Twitch channel because I actually started streaming on Mixer, as you can see on YouTube on my some of old uh, Resident Evil One, Two, Quantum Break uh, Mixer streams, and um, and when Mixer shut down, there's another one. That's another giant penis. They make a specific sp specific sound. You know what? pistol him first and then we'll switch the shotgun and uh, he was the one I was like hmm I feel like streaming resistance but then again twitch doesn't have an Xbox app this was before I had a uh, my uh, Elgato to just like record uh, stream straight from the console through the laptop so I had to use the built-in app right which mixer had a good one oh it's, I guess it's time to actually use the shotgun it sounds like two giant pieces. 
Yes! Before he gets up. Not there. What am I doing there? So he said like, yeah, the Twitch actually has an Xbox app. Let's stream together. And I did a couple of resistance streams, but my upload speed was horrible at the time. Oh, wow. One shotgun. That's it. Uh, but that's what kept the dream going. So that's actually why I didn't stream for almost a full year. My upload speed suddenly fell from... Uh, I was paying... Uh, I am paying for 10 actually five but I had always over five megabits upload and it suddenly went down to the two barely two so I just stopped I it felt defeated because my ISP wouldn't help they were really they were like yeah everything seems normal on our end and just as I uh, as I was about to end my contract with them I swear it was just okay yeah, that's why we have the wine bottle. There's some kerosene left in the heater, it looks like. If I had some sort of container, I could take it with me, I reckon. I don't know why, why she has... <laughs> why she sounds like a southerner. I reckon I could use these bottles here, and uh, like my granddaddy used to do, and uh, just fill it up with kerosene, because we couldn't make moonshine back in Silent Hill during the Prohibition era. We just all drank kerosene. In the wine bottle. I got an oil filled bottle. Ooh. This is for the moving this is for moving kerosene to and from a space heater. Of course I can't drink it. No it's not. It's just a wine bottle that you're repurposed for kerosene. Mmm just doing a checkpoint. I reckon back in the day when Silent Hill was still a silent valley. Ooh. We used to drink kerosene every day. We were the neighbors of Cowboy Cabin. You might have heard of Cowboy Cabin. He has a cabin somewhere in the Arkland Mountains. Shotgun shells and pistol boots, yes. What kind of machine is this? It looks like it doesn't work anymore. So yeah, uh, com com that combined some mutations, influence combined with yours in uh, Outbreak, where you were there just every day, zombie, uh, and uh, the fact that uh, my upload speed finally went up, that's why I went back to streaming, and I don't regret it. It's just one of those daily rags, nothing really useful written in it. Why do why should she now have an accent? Because this locker is filled with junk. No, it's not junk, it looks like somebody's stuff. Ah, oh, that hurt. Such a teenager. There's something scribbled all over the blackboard, but it's faded and hard to read. It doesn't look important anyway. Okay. Heather, we gotta stop that accent, girl. We can't use accents. That accent it belongs has nothing to do in Silent Hill. What kind of machine is this? It looks like it doesn't work anymore. Yeah, I kind of think there's a file here. That's what I'm looking for, but it's not this desk, I believe. She would look towards it. Not really useful written in it. Okay, let's get out of this room. There's literally nothing here. Is there gonna be a re... There's a re -penisation. That's not fair, game. I don't shit ammo. Oh, okay. I can lure one of them here. Here, wee wee. Come here. You're a nice wee wee. Who's a nice wee wee? You're a nice wee wee. A quack. A quack. A quack, I say. Oh my god, why are you strong, penis? Three hits should do the hit trick. Okay. Penis number two. My daddy told me not to speak to random penises in tunnels. Well, now they need four wax. Why? Am I weaker? When my health is lower? At least the giant one is sleeping. Let the lion sleep. penises sleep. I guess. Now, before I go out there, I think there's something there. There's gonna be a lot of those uh, annoying... Uh... There's another one? There's another one? What is this? A convention? Okay, it's fast enough to get them. I don't believe you anymore. All penises get four wax now. Ah, oh, look at him. Flatten down. 
Okay, I know what's in here, and I believe there's some health. I don't know if it's worth it. Actually, I'm not even sure there's some health, but I'm gonna check it out. Oh, jeez, okay, they can't see yet. Fuck him, fuck him, fuck him, fuck him, fuck him, fuck him, fuck him. Fuck him before they fuck you. Woohoo! Is there anything here? Oh my god, not even health? Not ammo? Nothing? Oh god. Yeah, I'm gonna check in once more because I don't accept there being no supplies for me here. When I troubled so hard to get here, I can't get shake this accent loose. Shake, get loose, get shake, shake, get loose of this accent. Whatever I'm trying to say. So that was pointless. I guess it just has a point on easy. Never mind. On easy difficulty mode. Okay, yeah, this is pretty straightforward. If you know where everything is, you can just run through it. I don't feel that mazy. I don't get that mazy vibe that I got from uh, the first two games. Which is why I don't play 3 as often. I like the atmosphere and all, but what does that say? Ah, she doesn't want to look up. Look up, woman. Ah, looks like it's saying Merchant Central Room. Yeah, whatever. Hello? Oh, yeah. She's gonna look down and be gross, grossed out. The hole's full of dirty water. I can't go down there like that. Like that? You mean, like, okay. Maybe you just... What kind of machine? It doesn't look... Okay, it's the same. Doesn't have much... Too many comments in machines. There's a hoist here. Hoist? But how do I get it to work? How do I get this hoist to work? This might be the fuel tank. There's something in it, though. Yeah, boss. Let's, let's put the oil-filled bottle inside, boss. Oh, that sound. I love the sound design in these games. Mmm. Kerosene in the fuel tank. Okay, now let's hoist. A hoist. A hoist. Will you throw the switch? No, I will push it. All aboard! Thanks for the visual of the hoist. <laughs> I feel enriched now, game. So, still no files. Thanks to that thing, all water is finally drained out of the hole. Looks like I'll be able to get down there now, if I can stand the smell, that is. Ugh. Hello? Anybody home? This must be where the water gets drained out. Yeah. I agree. I completely agree. A hoist! <laughs> the sound, the sloshy sound of walking on the... I'm walking on poop shine. Whoa! Kinda smells bad. Bam! 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 Okay. Lights on. Rookie mistake. Oh, okay, yeah, it's okay. Now, there's gonna be a, some scary shit here, right here, I think. No, not here. In the next bridge. I've been whacking down the penises all the lifelong day. I've been whacking down the penises. To you, I say, hey, hey. Oh, is it pendulum time? There's poop everywhere. Sun Hill, like the the heather, the heather. Oh, yep, I'm in poop. The Heather slash Cheryl trilogy. I mean, what? Uh, tr yeah, it's trilogy, uh, including what is that? Oh shit! It's a penis. Ah, let's see if you can do that. Can they do that? I don't want to find out. Kinda. Heh <laughs> heh 
as long as I don't bump directly into it. Come on, should go left here. There's the dying giraffe again. Is he coming this way? Sir? I guess not. I'm gonna try avoid avoid killing him. So let's go first we'll go to that other bridge because that's where we need to go. I guess we lost that wee wee. Wee wee. Now, this place. Just pay attention under the bridge. This is just to fucking trip you out. No other reason. Doop, 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 doop. Right about right here. Right about here. Yep. See that guy down there? They're gonna be common enemies later. Slurpers or something? I ca kinda logical they're called slurpers. It's even activating the radio, I think. But it's just lying there. Nothing you can do with it, nothing it can do with you. Just like Silent Hill. Okay. Now somewhere here should be a there it is. The camera will tell me. A dryer. And we have a ooh, an ampule. Yep, ample, ampule, ample. Ample. I will never have to jot that down. Oh, that's a, now that's a lot of garbage. Where the hell did it all come from? I guess this is all the stuff that gets tossed out into the sewers. Who tosses up things out of, into the sewers? How can you even toss things out into the sewers? They're protected. I'm just wasting my time looking around here. I better bet going. Get going. Even so, it really stinks. It's going straight from my nose to my head. That's how it goes. What about here? What kind of machine? Yeah. What kind of machine? A wheelchair? Why would a wheelchair be thrown out here? Out here. A radio. What's going on with that radio? Is that a clock? That's a clock. It's a broken clock. This is from the sewer too. Wow, she actually comments on a lot of more stuff. Well, sporadically she won't, but the deodorant inside, but it would probably be a waste of energy. Ah! There's nothing that looks useful in the cardboard box. There's a deodorant inside, but it would probably be a waste of energy. Uh, yeah, you can get a perfume later, which attracts monster, I think, in the hospital. And I think its purpose is to get you more creatures to kill. And now he's gone. He was just chilling there. As soon as you take the dryer, the guy's gone. A uh, dryer found in I uh, found it in a sort of garbage dump. Still looks usable though. Yeah, I can't check it. I think it's time to take this off for now. I'm sick of this half running. Run like the Linda Heather. No giant penis here. I know he's lurking his penisness somewhere around. Oh, you can't even go there. Okay, let's explore. No! Not in the poop! Why would you do that? Look, as long as we don't have any pendulums, I'm okay. Pendulums are fucking evil. Anything that flies and sings should be just... No. No. Fuck that. Eh. Yeah, there's nothing else here. That guy's still stuck though. There's Oh, he's trying to do that, but he can't. Sorry, Pee Pee. Goodbye, Pee Pee. <laughs> you know what? Do the poop! Uh. That's another big one. Okay.
I hear like a dozen of them. I don't see a single one though. There's, there's one small one. Let's get him over here alone. Hey there. No, I missed! Yep, fuck you. Two, three, four. I learned my lesson. Yeah, I'm gonna need this too. Oh, there he is. Let me just leave a bit. They're pretty blind, so if you wanna, if you wanna attract one's attention, I don't wanna disturb the others. So just use the light and and uh, should be okay. Oh, come here. Yeah, I want you. I want you so bad. Ah! I don't want the other one. I never asked for the big one. I guess it's shotgun time. I'm gonna be a man and reload the auto pit. Wow, instant down the penis with one shot. Run! Okay, that guy's dead. Don't. Actually, you know what? Pass him, reload, show him the balls. Show him he got the balls, Heather. Now reload. Like a man. And a woman. And then go back to the pipe. Yeah! No inventory reloading here. Oh, nice one. That, that, that was really good, BP. Ah! <laughs> they dodge like angels. Until they don't. Ah, uh, okay, that's my fault. I should have whacked him one more time. Feels like my controller is heart pounding. I can't tell with this one. Because uh, vibrations are quite lower. More peepees? No. Okay. That's blocked. We're close to getting to Hilltop Center. Now we have... Uh... I don't think we can go there, but I'm going to try anyway. Forget about it. It's broken. Okay. Okay, I like that. At least it gives me one route. One route and one route alone. Oh, good. Not really, but... Security mo... Is this a security monitor? Oops. I can't see anything. It must be broken. There should be a... Stanley file here. I can't tell what it says. It doesn't look like English. What? Really? Huh. Danger. Keep out. This was probably pasted on that door there. I can see where it fell off. That's... that's you, Yeah, that's why I, I like Heather. She's one of the most interesting protagonists. There are documents on the floor. They don't look like they have anything to do with me. But they've got today's date on them. That's weird. You could have just read what it, they say. I'm curious. Where is the Stanley? There should be a note for his buddy here. I think it's this is it. There's something written on the notebook. On the notebook. There's a monster in the water. The bastards killed two of my buddies. I should have never doubted that old urban legend about alligators in the sewers. But duh, have you played Resident Evil 2? There was no myth. But no one believes me. They were drunk and slipped. We're not that damn stupid. Even calling it a monster isn't quite right. This is something else. All I know is... Dot dot dot. Something's in there. I'm going in now to beat that thing's head in. If you find this note, consider it my will. Revenge is futile, or so you may stink reading this. But Jose and Jamie were my best friends. Buddies. Wish I knew how to do the deed. Guns won't work underwater. Even my famous knife work won't do much. If only I had a hand grenade. Are you David's buddy? Buddy? We don't know his name though. Checkpoint. Ah, oh, my eyes are burned by the red. The communist threat is in Silent Hill. There's nothing very interesting on the blackboard.
TVs you can drop lockers you can open monsters you can't kill okay okay so now this is a beginner's trap kinda if I try to go across this I'm I'm dead I'm instantly dead but there's an outlet here and we have picked up a hair dryer so uh, we were also in the sewers so no that's the weapons what that's weapons me what are you doing so items weapons supplies supplies yeah doesn't he sound like David even with the knife work she's so cold-hearted just not not even a flinch Blech. We never see the monster, though. Can I fall in? Should I... Ah, Galala! Yep, I can fall in. Now, there should be... I'm not sure... I remember this zombie. Now you help me. I'm not sure if it's in the remake. Uh, not the remake. If it's in the on the second run. But where's the, where's the pipe fairy? There should be a pipe fairy here. Was she here? Will I die if I fall into this? I kind of want to check, but on the other hand, I don't want to. So somewhere here, I think. Yeah, I think she's there on the only on the second run, though. The dryer's plugged into the outlet. Actually, it seems like this dryer has a longer cord than usual. Wow, the details, like, things she checked. Hmm. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Gold pipe and... Uh, silver pipe yeah that's on the second run I'm pretty sure there's no need to get the gold or silver pipe it's just for you know what kind of valve could this be I doubt it's anything important I'll just leave it alone for now I think it's yeah I think it's just for cosmetics basically it's it's a I think it's an old legend or something but I know it was also in the Zelda games uh, specifically a link to the past there's a fairy who as you drop items and she will return them to you until you drop I think it was the the bow or something bow and arrow she goes uh, which one is yours this gold or this silver and you're like no none of them I just had a regular one if you do that she'll be like ah you get the special arrows and bow or something and I'm not sure if this is a reference to that or not on or anything um, or just as to that legend itself. Yeah, it's not here. Okay, let's go. How far are we in the PP world? Well, not. We're actually pretty far. We're gonna exit now. PP world, PP world. This is where the PPs live. The drum is in the way. Drum is in the way. Everywhere you look around, there's something inside. I thought I can move it. You, what, cement? She doesn't really want to look up here, which is annoying. I want to look up, Heather. Why won't you let me look up? Oh, goody, another sewer. Oh, why am I not surprised? Yeah, you can't pan this map until you a circle. That's right. Me. So uh, one of them is the exit. The rest of them are not. Oh, you f fucks! I hate them. 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 So where do I go first? If anything kills me in Silent Hill 3, it's gonna be the pendulums. Okay, so there's nothing there. Nothing there. Keep the light off. You know what? Take the shotgun. I don't fuck around with pendulums. Still pretty good. Got 11 of these, so I should be okay. And still 4 of those. Just in case. Turn it white. 29, 18. Yeah, shotgun's got more shells, so... I'm pretty sure I can go around them without the light. I 
think they're down the tunnel. Yeah, they're down the tunnel. Maybe they even passed me, I don't know. I think I can... Oh. Fuck those guys. Not worth it. Okay. So I don't need the shotgun. Go back to my trusty pipe. That's not weapons. That's items. No, 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 no. Not the mall. Mall's too slow. And I'm gonna get the katana. Katana very, very soon, so... Okay, I think we can even go uh, without this. Is this place on the map? No. Yeah, basically we're gonna exit the... Uh... What? This is the lower end. Okay, yeah. And that's... yeah. So we're gonna exit just a street away from her home. Good riddance with the penis layer. Oh wait, we're not out of the. We're not out yet. Oh yeah, there's nothing here basically. Just a little to look around. There's stuff all over, but definitely nothing worth bringing along. I don't know that two by four or whatever. It's not a two by four. That that thing looks very dangerous. I can't get in. There's an iron grate blocking the way. Okay, good to know. I didn't think I can squeeze you in through there, but. Thanks for letting me know. No, no items? Nope, no items. And she's so funny when she climbs. She looks like a little frog ready to leap. Ooh, loading. There shouldn't be anything down here. There will be later, though. This wooden crate is shut pretty tight. I don't think I can get it open. Why are you saying it? Like, if I play this for the first time, I'd expect to be able to do something with this. But it's like, clank. Clankety clank. Okay, uh, fuck that then, uh. Step ladder. Is that a step ladder? I never knew my real ladder. Ah. All right. Building under construction. Feels like I did. Yeah, I love this place. This is one of my favorite SH3 locations. She stopped commenting on the circle, though. Just accepted her fate being blown up by the red by the red menace so i think i came out that on that side right nothing except for that no okay now we'll be safe here for now this is an interesting location before it goes oh yeah there's two actually locations. So first this condemned building and through that we're gonna go to uh, to the hilltop center. There's not even a map here I think. Nope. Electricity is off the elevator won't work. I don't know if it's building under construction. A step ladder, it's too big and bulky to take with me. But you never knew your real ladder. You should be grateful to at least have a step ladder. Really? What are you doing, step ladder? Bucket. Kick the bucket. There's a can of adhesive here. It doesn't seem too special. Hmm. There are bags of cement or something piled up under the stairs. 
I don't particularly feel like lugging these heavy things around. I doubt I could use them anyway. Gotta remember to... Uh, Well, that's not scary at all. Gotta remember to put on the... The bulletproof vest later. The toy floor. The third level ceiling has crumbled. For safety's sake, entry is forbidden. Okay, good to know. Never stopped me, but okay. So what location is this? Oh yeah, the safe thing told me, probably. See, David was here. He just left crumbles everywhere. A stepladder, it's too big. Oh no. Okay. The fourth level floor has crumbled for safety's sake and trees forbidden. So it's not just forbidden, it's blocked. God, she moves so much more like a human with, uh... Listen now. Listen. Listen. I was scared shitless the first time, the first time that happened. I mentioned a few times I'm an auditory person, I, uh, sound is really important for even like orienting and uh, Silent Hill is really good on fucking with those senses, which is one of the reasons I love love it so much. It's a plain old wash basin, 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 nothing special about it. It's a toilet. I thought this building was still under construction, but it looks like this has been used. Well, of course, construction works need to take shit somewhere, Heather. They, they're people. They poop, too. Will it repeat? You think something's approaching? The fear gets you the cold fear. An electric cord wheel and a bag of cement. I can't really use either of them. Okay. Now we're gonna find a... I think it's a secret item. Oh god, this camera will give me the... Make me seasick. Lots of empty bottles and cans. It looks like somebody was living here. Comment. More comments, please. No? No? Look at all that lumber they could have used. Like, they probably used to heat, heat up more. Let's look around before we do anything rash. There we go. There it is. Is she turning towards it? Well, that kind of makes it not secret. The wall color looks a little different here, and the material is different too. It might break if it's hit hard enough. Okay, let's hit it. Hard enough. Now this is where it makes sense to use the mall. That's right. Ooh, it's still smoking. Got a silencer. I can see the legs through the broken part of the wall. I hope those are just mannequin legs, but I guess I'm not that lucky. Just like the black cat. I wish I hadn't seen that. I think I'll just leave it alone. There's nothing I can do right now. Normally I'd report it to the police or something, but I guess that's not possible. Even if it was, I've got bigger things to worry about right now. I think I'll just leave it alone. So yeah, another example of changing comments and comments. And if we look here, okay, uh, stop brandishing that more. I can't. Show me the legs, not yours, but his. Something like that, yep. So I heard that's supposed to be uh, a reference to Metal Gear Solid, like both Metal Gear Solid and uh, 
and uh, Silent Hill being uh, published by Konami, even developed. But I'm not sure. I don't know. It could be just, you know, just awkward Silent Hill horror humor. There's a little hole made up of cardboard boxes and old blankets. I guess the squatter was living here. Yeah, that's how I learned the word squatter as a kid. Anything there? No. Yeah, that's all that's all of this we get. So to avoid killing myself down there, will she even talk about it? I can't see the fourth level floor. It's too dangerous to jump down from here. So I'd probably just break my legs if I did it. But if I do this, ugh, a filthy ma mattress. Will it drop it into the hole? Mattress drop mattress goes into the hole. I guess we can jump in now. Okay, anything else to pick up? Nope. Papers. Little hole made up of car. Yeah, that's that's the squatter hole. Okay, let's. Geronimo! That wouldn't break her fall. That would. <laughs> if if anything else, with such an old mattress, she would be just impaled by the rusty springs. But okay. We, I can look past that. This is the mattress I threw down before. Oh, that sound. I don't need that anymore. Well, it doesn't need you too, Heather. You monster. No items? No. Oh, even like the ventilation is broken. It's some rubble from the broken ceiling. It could be dangerous if I'm not careful. Yeah, that could be dangerous. Jumping on a mattress from... It's not even that high up. You could literally... Look. You, she could literally hold her with her hands. Uh, if she can brandish a mole, I believe she can do that. And, and just drop gently. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What you got to say to that, Heather? If that's even your real name. Spoilers, it's not. Okay, it's time to go out. Did I put the... Yeah, I definitely put the... <clears throat> The uh, protective vest on. We're gonna have some. Oh, will you stop for fuck's sake? Okay, that hurt. That hurt a lot. More my ego than my body, but you're dead. There we go. Asshole. Well, let's go to the mall. I mean, pipe. I meant pipe. Okay. She still doesn't have a map of this area. Ooh. I don't like those. She's liable to fall off. It's easy to kill her here. We are on the fourth floor. Um, in English or fifth in many other languages. No. Yeah, fifth, because we, no, third actually, because we uh, count, because we have a special name for the ground floor. It's ground floor. <laughs> okay, now we're getting somewhere. Okay, yeah, this is going to be interesting. Anything here to pick up? Nope. To my left. New location, new enemies. Welcome. The tabletop is covered with papers. I don't see any info that might come in handy, though. It's a thermal carafe. There's nothing inside. What's a carafe? 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 Caravan? It's a mannequin catalog. I guess this is the reception area for a mannequin company. Why would you need a reception area in the mannequin company? Like, people don't come... Do people come and be like, yes, I want 50 size 7 mannequins. Still good? Hello? Anyone home? Yeah, there was going to be a lot, lot of guys home. 
He's gonna check this hallway and then go back. No supplies, no. Well, one of them is gonna have a map. Not that one, definitely. That's not opening, I think. It's a fire door. A bit broken. That's a fire alarm. Ooh, I hit. If I can put the treats down, it should be okay. Yeah, let's see how this works. Zombie said use the treats. Using the treats. Oh, that, that actually worked? Yeah, they're fighting for treats because they can't see me. Thank you, zombie. That actually helps. I didn't know that they will work. So they will go for the food first in the dark. I never did this with less pain, I'll admit. It says, storefront passables. Posables? Posable. Thanks, man. That I thought they're broken all my life. All I needed was a zombie on my team. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, one of the best scares in the game. So if we check her now. This is the only mannequin with a head. There's something weird about the headless ones. Like they're they can still see me or something. Eek. Its head is the only noteworthy thing about it. It's just a mannequin. Arms and legs for mannequins. With no head or legs. I know it's just an inanimate object, but I'm still a little nervous. Afraid, maybe. Yeah, you should be. Did you hear what happened to James? mannequin body I know I know it's not real but it's still creepy I knew it was gonna happen fuck I just oh god oh god and I was said it one of the best scares in the entire series entire game man and then I still got jumped. And that's, that's, oh god. <laughs> it was beautiful. Yep, and there she is. This, this is blood. Yep, it is blood. I mean, you should be afraid. Look at that. So, randomly, this voice or Heather's voice will be heard. Now, I don't think anybody anybody's figured out yet what triggers them last time I checked what uh, decides which voice which voice will be heard when this happens but yeah it's either you'll hear this like higher pitched one I don't know who's that supposed to be or you will he hear Heather like herself screaming ah. fucking scary and this is where insane cancers become regular enemies just like we'll see more and more of them the elevated doors the elevated doors are open a little the space is too narrow to be on of, of any use though are you not gonna look through it nope That elevator works, if I remember correctly, and this should work. Yep. 10 p.m., I see. Yeah, there's going to be quite a few floors here, so uh, let's go one by one. Is there anything here? No. no. 
I think the elevator works too. Oh, it won't come. Is it broken or something? Okay. Monica's dance studio is going to have an insane cancer. You know what? Let's deal with that first. Fuck it. How many shotgun shells do I have? More than enough. 30. So oh, actually 26. Two shotgun shells and then maybe I can just go around it actually. Mall should be good for them. But I'm slower even than the insane cancers. So many doors. Let's start with the last one. Nothing interesting. Who is that the map? Calendar. Nothing interesting written in it. The note on the... There's a note on the locker door. I got a map of the building from Mr. Harris. Come to the office to get it. That, thank you. Got two hell drinks. Some magazines, but nothing really important. One of them I've already read. And the other one, the other just doesn't interest me. Hmm. Are they... Is this the office? Nope. That one is the office, I'm pretty sure. Yep. There are lots of papers, but not a damn important to me. desk is all cluttered up. It doesn't look like there's anything that I'm interested in. Oh. And... Ta-da! Got an office building map. Now, we've come in on the third floor in the storefront posables. We're now in Monica's Den Studio. Those two companies... Oh, there's third company. Yeah, the law company, the law firm. So, three companies on this floor. The fourth floor is all one-stop imports. The fifth is KMN Auto Parts and Gallery of Fine Arts. The sixth is Water Glass, DDAD, Gal Mal Geological Survey, Every White and Design Construction. Okay. And the first two... Eberton Life Insurance, Last Drop Cafe, <laughs> Last Drop, Echo Interiors and Floor Fashions, Green Ridge Mental Health Clinic, yeah, all these companies we really put a lot of confidence, nope, desk is all cluttered up, yeah, we've seen that, but what about this one, yep, yep, Drawers open just a smidge, but there, be, there must be rusted or something. I can't pull it any further. Okay, let's touch the checkpoint. And then run. Is there anything in the dance studio where the same cancer is? I can't remember now. So let's check. It's the best way to find out. They're pretty dumb on this, so let's put another one. Just in case, I think there's there are two insane cancers here, and we really don't need to kill them. Cancer's not up. There you go. Okay, so I can kill them one by one, and I think I can go around the cancer. just went to eat in another place. <laughs> okay.
He's not up, you see. No. Because that would scare me. I hate them. They're so fucking hard to kill. I know they're supposed to be like tank enemies, but Jesus, how much health can you have? Is it moving? I don't trust it. Should I whack it with a mole or try? Let's check the room for supplies first. I don't see any supplies. But I think this is just one of those rooms where you get in to fight enemies and that's the whole point. Screw that! Woohoo! Not worth it. Fuck it. Nope. A giant no. We're not doing the bad ending, so... I think they're only worth fighting if you have infinite weapons so no 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 locks broken pin prindle and enos law firm okay so let's start exploring i'm gonna say from the bottom or as bottom as we can get from the first floor The same construction type as the building under construction we were in. There's plenty of stuff behind the stairs, but it's all junk. J junk? J junk. Yes. Very okay. Okay, then fuck that floor. Scooby dooby doo. I came from the third floor, so we're gonna skip that one. And we're gonna go straight to the fourth floor. Fourth floor, one going once, fourth floor going twice, and sold to the lady in the white jacket. Nope, it's cock block. Okay. Fifth floor going once, fifth floor going twice, fifth floor going to the lady in the white jacket. Yep, that one works. What about the sixth floor? Can we go to the sixth floor? Floor six, lady in the white jacket going to floor six, going to floor six. It's broken. Well, fuck your hilltop center. All the locks are broken. Damn, these games really need a locksmith. I think that would be the most OP character. Just the ability to explore everything. Ooh, red. Wait. There are cleaning goods here. There's not much I can do with them. You could clean. Like, look at this place. It's a mess. <laughs> Thank you, John. Thank you. <laughs> I'm glad you appreciate it. Uh, uh, comedy and games, my two favorite things. <laughs> it makes my heart sing when you say things like that. Well, if you're going to bed, I, um, I wish you a restful night. Probably the rarest Pokemon in the adult life, especially as a parent, am I right? Hmm, all the locks are broken. No wonder you're failing. Can't even go anywhere. So we have auto parts where I know I'll have something, and on the other hand, on the other hand, Cloud, you have a machine gun. Ooh, yeah, we have a psychology thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's still auto parts. You know what? Let's go clockwise. It's when you give me these sprawling entrances game, I just want to shoot you. Is it slurpy time? Oh, it's just locked. Okay. Okay. Or we can get auto parts elsewhere. Hum. Am I going to meet Vincent? So, oh, no, no, no. This is another thing. Its title is Repressor of Memories. What the hell kind of title is that? I don't get this picture at all. You know what? Round, we don't 
We don't take kindly to pictures such as these round these parts, boy. There's a guest registration notebook on the reception desk. I think I can ignore it for now. There's a painted plate here. It's nothing special. Nope. Ceramic pot, pot. Not really my style. It's too big to use as a vase. I mean, you could break it against someone's head if you were crafty. Now, this is a calm, relaxing picture. Mountain. Nice and simple. There's a price written here. Let's see. 5000 Man, what a world. <laughs> oh, Heather. Looks like there was a picture here before, but it's gone now. Only the caption's still around. Flame purifies all. Flame, eh? Well, I don't know what kind of picture used to be here, but I'm not too fond of fire. Uh, it's scary somehow. You only, because you forgot shit, Heather, or should I say Alessa? Lock's broken. We don't take kindly to pictures such as these, around these parts. Where the fuck am I? Oh, right, 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 right. There's the screwdriver so I can screw myself. Box is filled with useless junk. I don't need any of that. You see, if you had any skills at all, Heather, you could make a fucking stun rod or something. Blaming the world on your issues, teenagers. Is this door open? Oh, broken. Is this? That's not a door. That's not a door, John. Ah, yes, here we are. I got a katana. It's a katana, but I don't need another one of those. You could dual wield. I think one is plenty. Too much stuff will just slow me down. Oh, yeah, definitely. Don't take the katana. Just carry around a mole, a shotgun, a pipe, a knife, uh, a, a fucking bulletproof vest. Do you know how heavy that is? Silencer, which I don't really use. All this shit, but no, one more katana. One of the lightest weapons. <laughs> a short katana, about two feet long. Pretty powerful and easy to handle. Right, right, right. But uh, what can you do? Wait, what did I see? I saw the silencer, which again, I don't use. because. So the thing with silencer is uh, put it on a handgun or submachine gun to muffle the blast. Yes, but... Less noise means it's harder for the enemy to find me. It seems to be a little weaker, though. See, that's what pains me. So, you know what? Fuck the noise. I already turned off the flashlight. I'm a good boy. I can I can handle some noise. See, that's a lot faster than the pipe. A lot more devastating, too. And tapping the button will give her a devastating that. Yeah, a swing. There's a bunch of paintings here. I don't know much about art, but I don't think this will be or of any use. I need a crowbar to open this crate. I need. I would need. A, okay, yeah. I'll just forget about this. You know, you have a katana. You can just slice it. Useless. Oh well, we can all be David. Okay, we're done with that part. I'm glad I dipped into this section of the map. Uh, is this where we came from? Yes. Art. Who needs art when you have a katana? Let me paint you a picture there. Oh, so that's the locked door I can go through. Yep. Now let's check them uh, auto parts. Oh, it's penis whacking time with my new weapon. How does this? How do you handle this? No? Just one of you? You guy. I need to test this on you. Ah, move! Woohoo! How does the block work again? Like that. Still takes three whacks of a penis, but... Ow! That was my face, you penile bitch. Eh. You too. Eh. Oh, just two wax. Okay. So three will become four will become three and three will become two. That's that's genius. That's genius. 
Okay, that's my new best weapon now, till the end of the game, I think. Where did I come from? The big door? Where did I come from? Where did I go? Where did I come from? Cut Nigel. E here, P P P P. P P P P P P P. Ooh, what's this? Oh, it's like a car catalog, I guess. Yep. Car parts, car parts. If only I had a car, this would be very useful. What's here? What have we got here, Shani? We got oh another. I think there's gonna be an enemy inside. Ah! What's the point of this? Ow! Oh. Yeah, the katana can stun him perpetually. That's good. So I can actually kill them now. Okay, he he wasn't stunned by that. I can tell you that much. It's time for one of these. Ah, refreshments. So when when he's doing his. Eh. He's alive. He's just pretending. These guys are very hard to... Oh! I can hit too, you know. Yeah, they're very hard to kill. They don't call them insane cancer for nothing. And I can't keep that blue for no matter what. I mean, in Silent Hill 2, I'm trying not to have full health. But here... Yeah, you melt, you evil bastard. But here, it's just like, I can't keep full health on me. Nothing? You're not gonna comment on anything? Just entered, killed a gigantic beast, and you're just not gonna say anything? She's speechless. Yep, there's nothing here. That yeah, was pointless, again. I guess for points. What's here? More rooms, sure. Broken. Broken. All of them will be open later in the other world. Unfortunately. Oh yay, office! More things to look at and more hell drinks and more shit. There are some papers on these shelves, but that's it. Nothing useful. You're not useful. This one is empty. Because somebody found something useful. Nothing interesting on the poster. KMN Auto Parts. A poster for this company. Well, it looks like a... It looks like... Almost like James's car, only not. It's a sports model. I got a jack. I got a jack and I'm being chased by penises. Can I jack the penises? Hmm. Oil and foil and stuff like that. I can't use any of it. You can. You so can use all of that. Nothing interesting. There are computers, but they do like look like early 90s computers. Actual desktops, not tower cases. So... It's one of the things that puts, for me, puts the game a little further uh, down the line in the 90s, more than 2000s when the game came out. For once, she doesn't have a cell phone. Just a bunch of serious looking papers on this desk. I don't need to take any with me. Again, you've mentioned oil, you got papers. You could just make a Molotov or something. No, there's nothing useful. I'm gonna carry a katana. Which I don't actually complain about. Honestly. Though I would love to see a Molotov in this game. Unlocked for the shortcut. Broken. And broken. Wow, like 9 out of 10 doors are broken. Sexy. Here, pee 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 pee. So now, do I want to be petty and go down there and fight that insane cancer, or just say fuck it? Fuck it. I mean, I will go down for the objective, but I have nothing to prove to him. Except that I still think there's shotgun shells in there. Wait. I was on the fifth floor? Yeah, you can't open any of them, yep. Third, that's what I want. Hmm. He will whack me at least twice while I do that. But I still believe there are some items inside. You know what? I'm gonna just take a quick peek. I need to go here anyway. Woo! Nope. Nope. That. Uh, uh, no. No. 
do I do have a katana? Be brave, little one. You can do this. You got enough health, and you're better than you were when you were a kid. So, you can jump him. So only the double whack will hurt. Wow! Look at me! Living and shit. Yeah, he's dead. He's melting. Look at that! I'm glad I did that. Always face your fears. Unless your fears are bullets. Do not face bullets. Bullets always win. Okay. Uh, Monica's Den Studio for the win. Yeah, this is where the ammo would be. I'm not wrong. I'm sure. Um, but there's nothing. That was just to... Oh, more cloth hangers. They were just to satisfy my ego and uh, and overcome my fear. And overcome it, I did. With a katana in my hand, I feel powerful. Okay. Now, in the items category, I should have a jack. Could use this to raise a car. You use this to raise a car when you need to change a tire or something. And a screwdriver. This flathead screwdriver was in the corner of the hallway. Oops. Pardon me. Totally ordinary. See, you can be smart when you want to. I got a rope. I can hang myself now. This this was in the drawer in a drawer in the office at the office. It looks sturdy and well used. So both sturdy and well used. Are those family photos or something? Yeah, they're photos. Maybe they're developers' photos or something. Look, there's photos on that desk. And uh, everything is kind of al al aliased. Aliased? When you know, opposite of anti aliasing. Al aliased, I think. Except for the radio. Huh, radio. What's going on with the radio? Checkpoint. 327, okay. So far, we've gone. Uh, an hour and a half of game time, two hours of actual time. Okay. Let's move this along. It's time to put all the skills I have to use. Okay. First jacket. Very good. And then... Right, she needs to look inside. Yep. The door downstairs looks like... Looks open too. No way I can get down there like this. Yeah, this is where I'd agree it would be very dangerous, but it wouldn't be impossible. The rope does help. Definitely. I use the rope. Do we use the rope to get downstairs? What else is there left to do? Ooh, lights, 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 lights. I'm not here. Is it broken or something? Ooh, another checkpoint. That all familiar pattern is on the on a piece of paper stuck to the vending machine. Who the hell put it here, there? It's not like it's the latest fad or anything, right? I mean, depending on where you are. That was checked. Many supplies. Supplies, Ashkol. So one of these is gonna... I don't even know where to start. It's all almost everything is the same company except here behind me then left. Wanna check which doors can open? Broken? Not broken. Mm. 
More beef jerky. A dog figurine. Looks real enough to bite. Does it though? Ah, she doesn't want to look. She's very specific where she wants to look at. Doesn't look like there's anything important around here. Around these parts. So yeah, I'm not gonna keep going. Actually, I can go. As long as I don't try the... Uh, the bathtub. Lamp hoods and flower vases. No, I don't need either. Underneath the covers are more display items. No time to be worrying about this. It's cracked flower vase. Is this supposed to be for sale too? Display of paper towel holders. There's nothing to see here. There are also toilet paper holders. Oh, that's the... Yeah, I'm not touching that. Green Ridge Mental Health Clinic. Okay, at least I know that. So I was in the right direction. So now, we gotta check out a certain bathtub. I don't think that's the one I've seen. But when we do that, shit's gonna hit the fan. Well, blood's gonna hit the gratings at least. A bathtub display. There's a dark red stain on the bottom. Just for display, I can't really be used. It can't really be used. Okay. Get ready. Action. There we go. That's the one. Not much interesting here. Guess I can just forget about it. Forget about it. Okay. So, I have bitched about the, um, the different voices. Most things in Silent Hill HD Collection. Pardon me. And uh, I always get gag when I uh, try to say that. And... Um, one of my biggest peeves with the uh, changed voice actors is this scene because of the way she screams in the original. Or rather grunts. Oh, I knew it. What were you expecting there? I never got that. What, what, what was she expecting to happen? Oh. That bit when her voice goes like ah, the new voice actress didn't do it good in my opinion. Just like the whole voice acting is so. Recognize that voice? That's Harry Mason. Harry, welcome back, Heather. Good to no, see you. Not again. Did she do this too? I'm twisting the handle, but nothing's coming out. Welcome back to other world. Look at that, look at that shit. What the fuck am I even looking at? Why does it have smiles on it and uh, it's not, it's like there but not even there, well, the way it's squishy, but then look at the pictures. What the shit? Amazing. Not gonna comment on that? Any of that? So nothing to say to this, Heather. You're like Eileen.
Okay, it's slurper time. I'm gonna comment on that. Nope. But just look at that. What the hell is this? It's someone hanging from a ceiling holding a baby. Jesus Christ. Walls rusty. What is she looking at? There we go. I knew there was something. Handgun bullets. The mummy-like thing in the wheelchair is just a doll. Or, or is it? Something about it makes me uneasy. Why, I wonder? And why is there a wheelchair in this building? Or a doll, for the matter? There's a doll in the wheelchair. I have a bad feeling about it. I think that's supposed to... Uh, that symbolizes her, actually. In her previous life, when she was uh, hospitalized, due to her mother trying to make her give birth to God, and then burning her, and, you know, all that stuff. Slurper time. Good riddance. Anyone else? I think this is where I'll meet Vincent, but don't hold me. Let me see if there's more ass. Okay, this is the hilltop center, how we'll see it for the rest of the session. Which elevator works? Which floor is this? Question number one. Second floor. This one doesn't work, but the other one will work, I'm sure of that. Okay, and then we'll just start going floor by floor. This doesn't work anymore. So let's start... Um, from the top. I think this is where we'll meet Vincent, right? Yeah, pretty sure. I don't know what kind of plant this is, but it's withering away. Poor thing. But she has compassion for plants. Oh, there's something here. Find the Holy One. Kill her? Huh? That's me! No shit! Who, who could have taken this photo? That's really creepy. Really for mental clinic. Mental! So, which door do you think? I'm gonna go to the. That one's locked. Okay, yeah, that's where we'll exit. Examination room. Sometimes the symbolism is uh, more obvious, but it's nevertheless it's amazing. There he is. Song. You say, but how do I know you're not with her? Her? You mean Claudia? Please don't lump me together with her. She was totally brainwashed by that crazy old hag. Abla, lots unfolding. I guess crazy old hag is a bit harsh. She was your mother, after all. Was. Was. Keep you on his side, and that big He's a pretty sneaky guy. Don't talk about my dad like that. Sorry. Animation. I apologize. Please 
calm down. Are you afraid that she's gonna beat your ass? I know everything. <laughs> I know about your past too. Then oh. tell me what's going on. You don't know even that? That's why I'm asking. If you know everything, then tell me how I can put an end to this. Not she's right. a bit longer. Enjoy? I feel like I'm going crazy. Doesn't this place get to you at all? Oh, it gets to me all right. I find it most fascinating. Wait! I'm not finished talking. Who cares? I knew you were on her side. How do you figure? She's smart. I'll give her that. Still, I'd like press him for information or something, but yeah, we wouldn't have the game then. So that ooh, Oxidol. All right, I'm done with these shelves. Hmm. Um, there's more here. There. There's a junior high school chemistry book here. When you pour diluted hydrogen per peroxide onto manganese dioxide, oxygen is produced. Although oxygen will not burn on its own, it will help other things to burn. Okay, good to know. What was I saying? Yeah, I think this song is called... Uh, I think that's A Stray Child, one of my favorite uh, Sound Hill songs ever. Let's... The intro themes are always... I haven't still talked about the intro theme to the first game, uh, to the third game. I will after this session, because what I'm going to say will would spoil for people who haven't played. But yeah... things I don't see. Sounds like dark. Is there more of them? Put the treat down and retreat. Okay. The treats are in supplies, right? There's a treat there. Go eat the treat. Ah! That works for me. Should be more of them here. Come to the treat. Should be able to sniff it out or something. Did I even use it? Yep. Ow! These dogs are bitches. Hit him, Heather! Oh, fuck that. You know what? Fuck it. If you don't want the treat... One last time. Get the treat! I'm not gonna ask twice. God, Jesus. Okay, I guess they're not hungry. See, they don't work always, zombie. I don't know why. Like, I, why these dogs can see me and the other ones couldn't or smell me. I don't have the perfume. Just a waste of health, in my opinion. not interested in eating at all. I don't know what's wrong. How do I make him eat when he doesn't want to? Ok. 
Okay, that works. Back to Katana. Alright. I think that's all we have to do on this floor. And now we gotta start exploring from the... Oh, wait, no. Whoa, we just started. Nope. Let's check around. Mm. Yeah, that's all. Let's go to the elevator and drop down the first one. Mm-hmm. Oh, they always kind of scares me. I don't recall exactly, but I should find the book here. So. Yeah, there it is. A book's lying here. It looks like a fairy tale. Once upon a time, there was a monster living at the gates of a village. It was a very scary and a very bad monster. It would catch people and crunch them up with its big teeth. The villagers were afraid of the monster and no one would dare approach the gates. Everyone was stuck inside the village. When the king heard about this, he summoned his knights. The knights eagerly rode out to defeat the monster. Ha! Take that! Their swords slashed and their spears flashed, but the monster wouldn't die. The monster tossed the knights into its mouth one by one, horses and all. What was the king to do? He fretted, he had fussed and paced the floor, but could think of no solution. Soon after, the village priestess came to the castle. She was a very kind and good person. The king asked her to defeat the monster guarding the gates. The book's torn, the rest is missing. I remember reading this a long time ago. I think I borrowed it from someone. I don't remember how it ended, ended though. Grr, didn't I read the story through to the end? Is this the monster from that book? If it is, and I don't watch myself, it'll gobble me up in no time. I can't tell where its mouth is though. What the hell? I don't want to get too close, but I don't think it'll attack me now. Why not? All bark and no bite? Anyhow, it's in the way. I can't get past it. And it's the ground floor too. This ought to be the exit. What a pain. I think there's even one where she says she feels bad, sad for it. What's that even supposed to be? Just just the twitching is unnerving. It doesn't, doesn't have to look like anything. Just make it twitch and bleed. And there you have it. Effective scare tactics. Can I see something to that? Did you just... Yeah, she will auto-aim for the monster. I think it'll attack if I try to attack it, something like that. Stop. Something's coming. Oh, that's another one of those cancer god fellas. All right, stun, motherfucker. No, oh, slap you in the face, bitch. Okay, not as good as the previous one, but still very good. Eh. Okay, she rested. Got the shotgun shells. This is supposed to be the bar. Yeah, this is the bar. There's a knife. That's actually a syringe. Is there someone, someone doing drugs here? 
Sir, drugs are not allowed in these bar, this bar, this here bar. Is this register broken? There's money scattered all over. The register and the cash aren't of much use to me right now. Well, they would be later, dum-dum. Hop the bar. Oh, you suck. You won't even hop the bar. Ooh, there we go, the fridge. For some reason, the only thing in the fridge is liver. I hope it's not rotten. Pork liver. The fridge is empty, obviously. And all all that's left is a red blood stain and one god-awful bloody stench. So if we check the liver, we got a few items to check, actually. So we got an oxidol. You, you use this to disinfect, disinfect cuts and stuff. It foams when you put it on. So hydrogen and pork liver. This was in the cafe's fridge. You gotta do something with it before it goes bad. It's really weird the items she'll pick up and the items she won't. I don't get it at all. I mean, for the purposes of the store, yeah, but there are cigarette butts all over the counter. Pretty yucky, but otherwise not worthy of mention. She will mention la later that she used to smoke dirty glass on the counter. It looks average enough. You're average enough. There's also a uh, bar at South Ashfield and uh, Southfield in uh, Sound Hill 4. Kind of laid out like this one. I don't know why it reminds me. What's my health though? Oh, yellow. Actually, I'm gonna eat one of those. Mm, I got enough. Yeah, blue. Finally, blue. Yeah. It's this one. Broken, broken. This is isolated completely. It's so weird what the other world does to one's senses. No, it's a, you fucking scared me like you're a real enemy. Oh, best elevator in the series, just because how we, how it works. How you can see the elevation occurring. Okay. Let's check the bathrooms first. Wait, that's not a bathroom. That is. I don't think any bathrooms will be open. I can totally get behind this. Uh... Wait, I was here. That's second floor. Huh. Behind this Japanese uh, control scheme. Yeah, I was here. Now it's off to the third floor. Number three. Oh, it doesn't, doesn't work. Well, number four. Oh, this one's a little different. Nothing on the bulletin board. Ah! Ah! Holy shit, that was close. I could have died. Oh god, no. We gotta be careful in the darkness. Oh, got the sweats. Okay, yeah. Giant holes gaping everywhere. Whew! That could have been the end. The bathroom's blocked. What kind of animals? Do they board, boat work? That one's locked. So yeah, that's where we're gonna exit. I think I know where this bit will end. Oh, they're both locked. It's... What is that? 
one stop imports okay so we can get there let's get to another floor and try not to fall off shit if it were hard i would have been dead because my reaction was very slow for that one five Another woody floor, watch out for holes. A holes. So, no way coming there or here. So, I guess I'm gonna go here. Slurpers, I think. A lot of them. There he is. Ah, oh, leave me alone. Ah, oh, you tricked me. Haha, <laughs> they do that. Come here. Ah! I will fucking shoot you. Don't make me waste ammo. This is just ridiculous. I'm being bullied by a little armored uh, artwork thingy. They die so many times, it's just not funny. Okay. Armadillos, I mean artworks. Okay. Sounds like someone's hungry. Let's go left first. Ooh, I remember this. There's a big sheet of glass in the way. It doesn't break when I hit it, so maybe it's not glass after all. I don't know why, but the world on the other side is calling me. I'm not gonna say that again. Have you tried hitting it before you had that comment? What does the map say about this area? Mm, let's start all the way there. If there's no holes, that is. There's gonna be a trickster here, I remember. What else? Matchbox, okay. Matchbox will be in items. It was in some company's conference room. Looks like it was used to light someone's cigarette. <laughs> well, okay, genius. You're a fucking genius, Heather. No more cigarettes for me. I quit for good. They couldn't do that today. Probably someone will be young cigarettes to the children, hide it from them, so they will never try it. Which is not how it works, but okay. Uh, not okay. Why am I saying okay? It's not okay. We shouldn't forget our mistakes. That's for sure. Oh, Jesus, scared me. Come here. Can I shoot them through this? No, come closer. How about a pistol? Can that shoot them from here? Oh, just hitting this. Okay, good to know. 
and that that place is here so wow it's out of map yeah there's gonna be places with their out of map spawn the boundaries There's the other side of that bit. That's the gallery. We'll come back here. Because we have everything we need for there. I just want to explore the rest. Here. What about the sixth floor there then? The elevator won't go to the sixth floor, I bet. Fast ran home. The wheelchair and everything is so creepy. Watch out for the holes. Just want to check the elevator. Don't want any trouble. Ah. Yeah, so third and six don't work, right? But everything else works, okay? Straight. And then straight again. No comments. Okay, we're almost done with this area. It's not nearly as hard as I remember. It starts being hard, like when I started the stream. The reason why I reloaded was because I fucked up badly. Like, badly in that beginning. But it's not like it matters. Here we go. Comment. There's a caption under the picture, flame purifies all. By these remains may a person find the road to paradise. I've seen this picture before. No, wait, I've never seen it. But I do know it somehow. Okay, there's a bucket. We're going to use that in a minute. Just want to check these doors. And these doors. Yep, never mind. The picture that was here is gone, now there's just a caption. So everything's flipped around. Pictures that were there are not there and vice versa. The, a vase is broken here on the floor. Looks expensive too. What a waste. There's a vase here, nothing inside and not interesting otherwise. Not gonna comment on that at all? Okay. You're weird sometimes, Heather. So now is the time we combine. We combine the items we've been collecting, which are Oxidol, Liver, and Matchbook. Matchbook? Yeah, Liver's got that Magnesia stuff. Really teaches you a few things, uh, this game. <laughs> About chemistry and... Science. Not creepy at all. I mean... No. No. That smile... I think I had a pin. Like, you know, a badge, a pin. Somebody gave it for me to me as a birthday with this almost exact smiling mouth that you know it's hard to tell smiling mouth apart from each other, but wide open smiling with a lipstick and all just so familiar. Maybe they even use the same design. Who knows? Hey, 
Thanks for the follow, Sky. Nice to see you here. Oh, man. Here we go. The company's gathering. Hey, hey. What's up? What's this? What might this be? The rest of that fairy tale I read earlier. The priestess accepted the, accepted the king's request and went to the village gates. But when she saw the monster, she tried to convince it with words instead of killing it. Shut up, you. Shut up, you. I'm gonna eat you up. The monster didn't listen to a word the priestess said. But she kept trying to convince the monster to give up. It's wrong to eat people, you know. The monster grew very angry at this and attacked her, killing her with a single mighty blow. Okay, there's more, there's more. That's not the last portion. Let's put that vest on. And bravely forward. Oh, fucking slurpers. Yep, this is the other side of the hallway. No, it's not. This is fourth floor. Huh. Shoot them. They're not worth the katana. Shoot them, shoot them, shoot them with a shotgun. Fuck it. They're as bad as those pendulums. He's gonna get up. I know it is. Yep, I call it. Uh, no, no, we don't talk. So on this channel, when we start to, when we try to say the HD, that happens. Yep. So we don't talk about that. We don't take kindly to HD remasters now around these parts, boy. Fuck you. Oh, are you shitting me? They're, these are the fucking demi gods of the Silent Hill 3 C game. You can actually keep stepping on them. Ah! Oh, every time! How can I check if it's dead? Kick him. Ah! Oh. You dead? Fucking assholes. There's another one there. Yeah, I don't feel bad wasting pistol on them. Ah! Oh, every time they trick me! How does that actually work? Woo! Kick it on the side. Stroking out on the floor. Oh god, it's dead. Finally. Jesus. Yeah, the HD remaster... Uh, remaster, it's... I wouldn't recommend it to people who have played or who haven't played Silent Hill 3. Or 2, for that matter. The one good thing I can say about Silent Hill 2 in that collection is... You can uh, choose between uh, the original voices and the new voices. And even though the crew is stellar, uh, for instance, um, yeah, I always put the console in there, yep, so people can know. Um, even though Troy Baker is the voice of James Sutherland, that's not James Sutherland, that's supposed to be Guy Sihi, uh, Wehi, I don't know how to pronounce that uh, person's name, but yeah. The original James voice actor and you know I get the bugs it's not the developers fault as we all know uh, Konami just gave them a unfinished beta code and said make a game which is not how you run a business but who am I to say anything oh where are we oh hey I remember this so oh there he is see that guy there How's the bullet situation? They eat a lot of bullets, Jesus. Dare to trick me, I know it is. She won't even care about him until he goes out, okay? Let's check everything else then. So I wouldn't... I could forgive the bugs, even though they're sometimes just bleh. 
ugly but then the fog oh my god the fog is non-existent like after after the mm. hd collection i played uh i played uh, a few weeks ago i played the ah you, i knew it you bitch i played the original just a few swipes huh if you can get them and uh the the difference just in the fog is stellar Yeah, I was playing it on the, on my Xbox One actually through backwards compatibility. I finished the f second game barely, just couldn't stand the the changes. Well, there are a lot of uh, there's a good number of small changes that a lot of people, including myself, some of them didn't notice, like the signs have been changed, all that, all the missing resources. But oh god, then we come to the fog. It's just one of the most important things in Silent Hill. It's not there; it's just a few lines of lesser visibility fuck you fans and um and silent hill 3 i started i think i didn't finish it i still can't remember i talked about this in a few previous streams on silent hill 1 and 2 uh i'm not sure this should unlock the other side right or not i am completely wrong Yeah, okay, that's where I came from. Keep following the hallway. Nice. Um, I couldn't stand the the new voices, which no one asked for. Wait, what is that hanging there? I couldn't stand Heather's voice, Douglas's, not to mention. Jesus, it doesn't sound... I, I don't know. Voices are important. Oh, I see. Well, I would be afraid of playing uh, the uh, HD collection on my own or with someone else. I can tell you that much. Sound Hill is scary enough on its own. <laughs> Where are we? But yeah, the third game, I believe, is where I lost patience. Wait, these guys should slurp, right? The meat. Slurp them. You know what? Let's run opposite way of that scary sound. Nope, there's nothing nowhere else. Actually, if I put the tree down, let's try it. This rarely works for me, but let's try it. Hopefully it'll work. Oh, nice. So that's how you get them, right? Get them with the meat. I can tell when you're alive, asshole. All right. Yeah, the fog is just non-existent there. It's and that's not that. There's so many glitches and bugs. I've had uh, lying figures just like uh, things are twitchy enough as it is inside. Like sounds like there's another one. Right, but then you have oh shit. Where did he come from? Then you have these assholes, just... Yeah, straight in the head. They're just uh, glitching into the walls, out of the walls. Oh. I guess he just appeared out of nowhere. Um, I don't know, It's it's broken. It's so broken that... That's why I have this gag to gag every time I mention it, because it deserves it. Again, it's it's a very tricky situation, silver coin. The lamps shining on some old silver coins I know I've seen before. I got one earlier, so I shouldn't really take any more. I mean, I'm no thief. I might act like one now and then, though. I don't need any more coins. We don't take kindly to coins around these parts. Okay, we got a coin. Yeah, this is kind of useless. Why am I doing it here? There's something written on the wall. Thus, thus one's life turns to riches. What was, what was a bag of silver coins is now the number in a book. Yet faith hath no price. 
Ah, but do people know this? So if we check, if we, if we, Heather, if we check, Heather, just a plain old vending machine. This one is selling canned drinks. Come to think of it, I am kind of thirsty. I'd feel weird drinking anything sold in a place like this, though. Okay, she doesn't change that comment. <coughs> oh, pardon me, I'm going to mute myself. Okay, um, that would be in items. Silver coin, it's about the size of a quarter. I get a feeling it's really old. Kind of looks like a Serbian coin, I'll say, with the shield and everything. When I try to do that with a key in a can, it never works <laughs> until I cut open the can. Okay, life insurance key. That's pretty obvious. Bought this from a vending machine. It looks real enough. Okay, we're basically finished this section. There's a tag on the key that says Alberton Life Insurance. Okay. Um, I don't know if you know... Hold on, is there something? Looks like oh, it's just wire stretched. Okay, I don't know if you know Skylands, but there, if you have a sale of uh, sale, a save file of Sand Hill Two on the same memory card where your so it has to be memory card one, yeah, because Sand Hill Two can save on memory card slot one or two. Sand Hill Three can only save on save on memory card slot one. Coins and bills. Of course, it's not like money might come in handy. And it goes without saying that it would be nice to have. But I think I'll pass on it anyway. No, forget about it. So yeah, she changes some comments. I love that. Um, so if you have a save of cleared Silent Hill 2 on memory card slot 1 when you play 3, there are secret... Uh, oh, again? Seriously? Put, put, the, put the cookie down. Put the cookie down. Just a little space for myself here. Oh, that actually works. I never thought it would work. Wait, kill it before it devours it. Ah, yeah, that's the thing. They're, they're faster. I gotta get him somehow without him getting me. Yeah, food's the trick. Who does trick them somehow? Are we done? No, there's more of them. How can I tell? The music didn't die. Oh, it's just the doggy. Will the doggy eat the treat? Damn, I'm using these like there's no tomorrow. I never used them before. Yeah, what I was gonna say, there are references to Silent Hill 2 and Silent Hill 3 with that save file. So I found one. Uh, I tried to find them as a kid so many times because I heard about them. I thought it's a myth for the longest time. But... Oh, fuck that dog. But I didn't know because I would always keep my Sand Hill 2 saves on memory card slot 2. Uh, I didn't know that's the trick. Just keep them, just keep it all. God. Well, keep it all on the same memory card. And uh, one of them was she refused to do something that James does in Sand Hill 2. And she even had a. Uh, fourth wall breaking comment about it. That was one. Uh, we're about to see the second one as soon as we get to Daisyville Apartments. Going down. Get down, down on the ground. Don't mind me, I'm just carrying my katana. So life insurance will be locked. And, uh, oh, I wasn't even there. I never even tried the door. There we go. Oh, for fuck's sake, with the slurpers and... Mm, I'm gonna go right first, because it's shorter. Broken. Broken. I 
hear the meeting. Munching. Sounds like they're devouring some Jesus. Yeah. Okay, do we want to kill them both? Just ignore them. Fuck them. Okay, that doesn't look good. Between that's supposed to be life insurance. I like how she hugs the pipe. Uh, the main gag the last session was find someone who will hold you like Heather holds the steel pipe. Just like my precious. And when she's walking with it, look at her. Mm, just hugging it, keeping it close to her heart. But with Katana, it's not like that. He's just like chilled. Okay. Well, let's read the rest of the story and that's how you beat the boss. Somewhere here? Yeah, there it is. The final part. The end of that fairy tale. The king and his people shed tears at the death of the kind priestess. God took pity upon them and granting their wishes, wishes healed the priestess. The priestess opened her eyes just as she had done every morning of her life. She went once more to the monster's lair. Fool, you wish to die again? No, this time it's your turn. The priestess had come to defeat the monster once and for all. As this priestess was, was very, very kind, she felt sad about this task. But it had to be done. Swords and spears won't work. Arrows and bullets will just bounce off. You can't kill me, the monster laughed. But the priestess used neither sword nor spear. She chanted but a single spell. Tu fui ego eris. Do you know what happened then? The monster let out a huge cry and then died and vanished. Thus the village, villagers were able to use their gates once more. Everyone lavished their gratitude upon the priestess, and they all lived happily ever after. <laughs> tu fui ego eris. Great writing. <gasps> what was that? You killed the monster, you dummy. You just read the instruction manual. Are you fucking stupid? Ah, oh, these people. I swear to God. I swear to God, Heather. Okay, so uh, the door's open now, apparently. All the monsters are gone, too. There's a carcass. Bunch of junk blocking my way. Okay. I think we're free. We can take this off for now. We can run faster. Like a human being. Like a... Like a human being. And the monster's gone. Are you gonna read it again? No, but she's not gonna comment on it being gone. I can unequip because there's gonna gonna be blah, not gonna be any monster any battles. Oh. oh, here we go. Normal world again. No, she was in Hilltop Shopping Center, right next to her home. So she's traveling from, uh, from the... Uh, I forgot what's the name of the shopping mall. Uh, using the subway, the uh, underpass, the penis lair, the, uh, the, the building under construction, finally through the Hilltop Center just to get home. We're taking her home now. My house is really close to here. Okay, yeah. Sign for a cafe. Oh, that's the one I was just in. Yeah, but you weren't in the normal version. You should visit it when it's good. That's all. Pardon me? My apartment is the other way. But, but what is this thing blocking the path? Am I still having the nightmare so close to my home? Yeah, my home. My dad. Is he okay? I'm sure he is. It must be. 
well uh, I'm sorry but as George from Outbreak would say I'm sorry but she's not gonna talk anymore so Heather I keep saying this is the most she's the Sound Hill protagonist with the most personality I will give her that even though Sound Hill 3 is among my least favorite Sound Hill games uh, I love the, the the atmosphere and the protagonist. I don't love the story so much. Yeah. Look, that's Eddie's van. That's Eddie's van from Sound Hill 2. What's he doing here? Eddie? Eddie? Oh, now we know what happens to Harry. It was Eddie all along, that monster, brutal killer. And so the car models are all from Sound Hill 2 as well. And uh, there's something that looks like a Norwegian flag there for no reason. I, haven't, I don't have anything else to do in this building. I have to get home. What building? Is this the building under construction? No, no that one should be right next to Hilltop. Okay. 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 Let's check the rest of the street first. Is this my building? I don't want to enter it and then not be able to leave. Oh, look, it's closed here as well. No rest for the wicked, Heather. No, her apartment is on this side, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's right there. So let's check. Uh, let's check this building. Goddamn stubborn camera. Harry. I know she runs faster without the armor, but she also rests longer. Ooh, is that a police car? No comments on the police car, girl. And everything looks like a padded cell. I mean, when Eddie's van is here, that's per perfectly okay, but, uh, hmm. Can I even look at it? Okay. Nothing on the car. Okay, rest, you're annoying. Oh, she rested. That's her building. Nothing there. Okay, get ready for the second Silent Hill 2 reference. Coming in uh, 10 seconds or less. Daisy Villa apartment. Yes, yes, you will rest. Here we go. When will it ascend? So let's see. What's my apartment so I don't get into the wrong apartment? Oh. Okay, uh, no, that's in items. That's def I will need this, though, very soon. So let's get it prepared. And, and, what does it say? 102. Okay, we don't want the door 102. Definitely. Is this 102? No, this is 103. That's not my place. No comments? Just a dust shoot. Nothing to worry about. Well, if you're James Sunderland, Sunderland, there's something to worry about it. Eh. But let's check what is this door. It will actually tell me which is mine. Not my place, not my place. That's 103. I, I believe we already had 103. Am I going crazy here? It's probably 105 or 106. I don't think that kind of mission would happen here, but let's check. Yep, that's. I swear to God, that's 103. Huh. Maybe it's 105. Doesn't matter. Let's go. Let's keep going. So it's not 10 seconds or less. I lied. But here we go. Sun Hill reference number two. The mailbox is empty. Wait, there should be a reference. Why is she not saying it? You should say it. What's this doing here? That really pisses me off. It's like having someone spit on your sacred place. Looking at that makes my head hurt. What does it mean? <laughs> she should say something along the lines of 
no letter from a dead wife, I think. Okay, we know it's on the ground floor, but people like exploring, Heather. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong. With the first reference worked, the first one worked, she should say, no letter from a dead wife, I'm pretty sure. Maybe not that one. That's 102, the camera will tell me. Maybe there's more there. That's not my place, okay. Huh. I don't know if I'm missing something, but you don't actually get anything by uh, by unlocking them all, by triggering them all. I just, I would love it to be there. My Sun Hill 2 save is definitely on this memory card. Oh well, time to see my dad. Use the house key. Going on. I think we should... It's the same model from Sound Hill 2, the dead, the dead James. Dad? But you can kind of see just the mouth and the chin, and you, you know it's hairy. Yeah, that's that's that should be the reference here. Maybe I'm at the wrong mailbox. Poor Heather. You get blood on your face. I mean, I, I feel sorry for her, but Jesus. Valtiel? No, not Val Valtiel. The other guy. Yeah, Claudia ordered it. We're gonna see very soon. Actually, right away. That's why I said I'll, the shotgun will come in handy. You know what happened to him, zombie? He didn't listen to the radio. Yeah, I forgot his name. The boss. It's not that hard. Just pump him full of shells and he'll be done. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck your dream. It's and twisted. He took you away from us. How dare he try to help raise a healthy child. She's got blood on her shirt. Yep, it's gonna stay. That's why. God, not the God, a God. <laughs> no, not the pistol, not good enough for her. We need something stronger. She's like, mm -mm. he's the one who killed your father. I merely gave the order. So, what will you do? If she were smart, she would just put a bullet through her head and finish her job with him. There, she said it. She said it. So half the game, we're not even in Silent Hill. I, I just... I can't. This... Oh, well, my controller's off! Oh, fuck. I knew this was gonna happen in the boss fight. I, I called it at the start of this one. Holy shit, that was not good. Okay. Okay, when the cutscenes are playing, check the controller. No, it just turns off, like, after a minute when the cutscenes are playing and... Used a lot of health now. Gonna have to sort that. That's a fucker. Right there. Just run around. It's not really good. Yeah, and I don't have the bulletproof vest on. That's double mistake. Yeah. That's why he got me too red. 
I never actually explored this balcony or whatever. Fuck you, boy. I'm just trying to see what's around here. That's blood, where he cut me for the first time, but there are no items. Kind of looks like the hospital. <laughs> Got you, asshole. Okay, how's my shotgun? One shell left, okay. Am I even hitting him? I should probably get him while he's down. I forgot about that. Cut his face. What? Are you running away from me? <laughs> Come back and fight, you wussy. If I remember correctly, Heather Mason is actually a reincarnation of someone. Yeah, a lesser Gillespie reincarnated uh, into Cheryl Mason. Who then, if you get the best ending in Silent Hill 1, reincarnates into Heather Mason. This is her third life for all intents and purposes. You can see my Silent Hill 1 uh, stream. It's on YouTube. Part 2 is coming out tomorrow. Because YouTube is a little like a month later than what I do on Twitch. But yeah. Now cut him. Yeah. Uh, this is the run where I'm doing... Yeah, they're both the same. All three of them are the same person. This, so, being my first. Ow! Oh, that hurt, you know. Being my first Twitch run of Sun Hill Games. Oh, come on. I could shoot him, but. Ow! Oh, come back here, wuss. Are we, are we chasing each other in circle? Yep. <laughs> mm. Oh, that's a good one, sir. That's a good one. I'll give you that. Okay, that doesn't work. Okay, that's a waste of ammo now. You know what? I don't like waste of ammo. So, I don't respect you when you make me waste my ammo. Oh, he's down. Did I kill him? Kick him while he's down. That's right. Okay. Oh. Like I said, I'm not a fan of the Silent Hill 3 story. I love the atmosphere. The soundtrack is one of the best in the series. I love Douglas. My condolences, that's how you start. Calm down. I just Calm down? How am I supposed to do that? My father is dead. He's murdered. Get out. This is all your fault. If it were for you, I'm sorry. Then go. He didn't know. To make you feel better, I will. And then he didn't leave. No one here to give him a decent burial. <sighs> so how do I? What do you do now? I'm going to Silent Hill. What's in Silent Hill? This song's called uh, Love Me Once More, I think. Of course it isn't. I don't 
don't know what kind of hell is waiting for me there, but I've got no other choice. I don't care about God or paradise. If that's what she believes, then fine. But she won't get away with what she did. When I find her, I'll kill her myself. Revenge doesn't solve anything. Maybe not, but that's what I'm going to do. How are you going to get there? None of your business. I'll give you a ride. I don't need your help. Yeah, but it's too far to walk. Besides, I'm partly responsible for this. I'll bring the car around back. Come by when you finish saying goodbye. You know, you might die too. That's fine. Nobody's gonna cry over my grave. Ugh. Okay. Let's explore the house a little. Nothing odd, odd about the TV or the VCR. Dad's bookshelf. There's nothing unusual about it. I'll find that woman and make her pay. I promise I will. I wonder if my dad would be mad at me for thinking that way. I'll be back, Dad. I promise I'll come home soon. That's it. This is the closet. Nothing to do here. She's just looking towards his body. Creepy. Okay. <clears throat> Wait. The notes. Nope. Not here. Books on the table, just his usual detective novels. My dad loved them. Dad, why did you have to die? You told me you were the strongest man in the world. Liar. Ooh. As much as, you know, I introduce comedy into my streams and all that, sometimes it's hard with Sun Hill games. Specifically with the end of Sand Hill 2, this bit and the end of Sand Hill Shutter Memories. Besides, Douglas is waiting outside. Wait, where's outside? Is, that... is this the entrance door? Who could eat something in a situation like this? Well, I could. It just makes you healthier. Really nothing? You should eat though. It's good for you. That's the entrance. Can't reach anybody, not the police or the church. Church? Why would that be your first? So this is her room, right? <coughs> yeah, this is where I'll get the taser. Which... In Silent Hill 3 it sucks, in Silent Hill 4 it's a fucking BFG, a stun gun. Silent Hill 4 it's a... This is my dresser, I don't need to change, I'll leave it alone. Silent Hill 4 it's kind of a secret weapon, it's not easy to find it. So, um... But once you find it, you can pretty much just finish the game with it. High voltage to zap the bad guys. It has to touch them, touch them, though, so it's very short range. My worry war dad gave this to me just in case. I don't usually carry it with me because it's because it's bulky. Why is there? Oh, because it's bulky and gets in the way. Yeah, but not now. Okay. 
how stinking rich were you people like he has his own bedroom with a bathroom you have your own bedroom with your own bathroom just like that's not that's not common here where i live definitely usually one bathroom is shared by the whole house or if you're lucky there's two i don't remember exactly when but i think i got this doll at, at a garage sale i still like it but there's nothing i can do with it right now okay I'm exhausted, but I don't think I can sleep now. Besides, Douglas should be waiting for me outside. Her room is really sweet, I will tell. Because I, I like our architecture, I like houses and uh, and, uh, and apartments. And One of the reasons probably why Resident Evil and Sand Hill attracted me so much. Because of all the interesting architecture. And this is a sweet room with the wooden floors, floorboards and all that. Morning always comes. It's corny, but it's true. But if your eyes are closed, it's all. it always feels like night. That's the hero's line from this movie. I always liked the line, but now it just seems stupid. Just a movie poster. So it says 1975. September 5. Februa? 1977, September 5, Libra. Wait, September 5th isn't Libra. That's Virgo. I don't know if that's supposed to be the date when this is happening or not. The director... It doesn't say director. Yep, it says director with, a, with an E. Found, well, I can't read that. Wait, nothing else there? Sure. Because once I leave, there's no coming back. But nothing to read? Nope. Nothing here? Nope. Goodbye, Dad. I'm going to avenge you. Don't go anywhere. Oh yeah, maybe I can read it now? Maybe it's now? Hold on. It's not all lost. Where's the... Yep. She's not saying it. Say it, damn it. Oh, it never worked properly for me. So last time I did it, but not now. Why? She should mention a letter from a dead wife. I'm telling you. I know what I saw. Maybe here somewhere? Is there a mailbox here? No. Oh well, kind of disappointed. Maybe they have a mailbox on their own? I'm trying to see if one of them will trigger it. Nope. I'll just check the apartment once more. Yeah, I don't know why it doesn't work, but let's get on. We're gonna... Ha there's gonna be an important conversation in the car now, as they're heading to Sun Hill. Maybe it's in the motel. I just met some guy named Vincent. Vincent? He's a friend of yours, right? Well, I'm not you're sure. not really bright, Douglas, are you? I like you, man, but you're not really bright. To look for a guy named Leonard. And he gave me this map. That he stole off of James's corpse. <laughs> we can't trust him, but we've got no other choice. What's this? Your father was holding it. So I just took it as evidence, but then I returned it. Oh boy.
Mm, I got the chills from the wind. Started raining. No shit. <laughs> Hey, are you sleeping? What's the deal with Silent Hill anyway? It used to be a nice, quiet little town. But now... Once, on a missing persons case. Never did find him. I think he's talking about James, though. We know what happens to James in the in the canon ending, canonical ending. So uh, makes sense. Sorry, didn't mean to offend you. No offense taken. Anyway, how about you go up in Portland? Wrong. Feeling sick? My head's pounding. It's like the worst hangover ever. This one's called song uh Letter from the Lost Days. You can hear no. Mary singing. I'm just trying to remember. My childhood. Something terrible happened in Silent Hill seventeen years ago. A woman named Dahlia. She tried to summon the ancient god of the town. She offered up her very own daughter. It's crazy. Maybe so, but it worked. The girl gave birth to a god. Huh? You see. That girl had special powers. Powers? Her classmates called her a witch. She could make things happen with her mind. She could kill people just by wishing for it. But in the end, that god was killed by a single person. No, it was me. I controlled him. It was me. Me. Unfair. Hello, over here. <laughs> I mean, it's not fair. Taking all the credit, Harry. She was holding a baby in her arms. That's because I tried to get the best ending. If it was up to Harry, he would just be standing there. She gave the baby to my father. Oh, the angles! Oh my God, such a masterpiece of, of directing and. She's remembering. I never had a chance. It'll make sense, trust me. You. I could tell you how happy you made me. Fun fact, if you didn't know, uh, Mary Elizabeth McGuinn, who sings for Silent Hill games starting with Silent Hill 3, 
is the voice of Alex Wesker from Resident Evil. Check out the hospital. Yes, That's sir. Map, right? Yeah. You don't need a map. Douglas. I'm not a child, you know. Why would you leave her alone for first, but okay. Are you uh, sure it's not you who's afraid to be alone? Honey, we're all afraid of being alone. That's right. human. Something years old. Never seen nothing like this. Never seen nothing. Double negative. Go back to school. Just feel like I'm dreaming. <laughs> More like a nightmare, I'd say. <sighs> yeah. I want to wake up and have a smoke on me. Meet me back here when you finish looking around the hospital. Okay? Roger. Yep, that's Alex Wesker. That's uh, when I play Resistance, I love to listen her, to her taunts because I ke keep hearing Mary Elizabeth from Sand Hill. Okay, yeah, controller. Gotta, gotta learn now that I have a wireless controller. It, I will have to turn it on after each cutscene. It's a bathroom, I don't need to use it right now. Well, how long you've been running and without shower and everything? I'm really amazed you don't need to use it. Honestly, I am. Here. Time to put on my vest. Is it though? Yes, I'm gonna say yes. Couldn't even heal while resting in the car. Boo! Boo! Not not cool, man. Not cool. Do I have the light? No. Yeah, there's one thing though before I save and end this session. I'm gonna no point in turning on the TV. All I could watch is snow anyway. Well, you're not James. You could see something else. I'm just gonna um, read the file from Harry. Oh, wait, it should be here actually. Yep. Dad's notebook. Dad wrote about my past in here. As always, this should be novelized. To my daughter. I hope this will never come to any use. Maybe it's better if you never know. More than anything else, I fear the possibility of your going away, far from me. But something, sometimes we have to tell the truth. That's why I'm writing this, before I'm lost in death and oblivion. What happened back then? That has something to do with who you are. It all started 24 years ago. Coming back from a vacation, my wife and I found a baby on the side of the highway. Since we were childless, we thank God for letting us meet this child, this girl. We took her home. The authorities never asked a question, apparently. Yep. Uh, three years later, my wife died, and another four years later, 17 years ago, I came to Silent Hill. I heard the girl's pleas and took her with me, not knowing why she wanted us to go there. And it was there that the girl went away. Not that she actually went anywhere, nor did she, nor did she die. Return to her original self. That's what Dahlia Gillespie said. Gillespie, I mean. Original self. That was the young woman burned by her mother as a sacrifice to God. Alessa Gillespie. I keep wanting to say Gillespie. Half her sore soul escaped in those flames and went on to live in a baby. In that girl of mine. Of ours. Seven years passed before that half a girl returned to Silent Hill and made Alessa whole again. This is Silent Hill 1, right? Newly strengthened, strengthened she vowed to kill God. God a, fetus, a, God, a fetus nestled into his this sacrificial girl's womb, was summoned with the usual right. You, what's usual about that? Jesus, these people! This was Alessa's wish, no matter what the outcome, even if her own existence were at stake. But that wish was not granted. My interruption meant she prayed instead for the girl's return. I alone couldn't bring her back. Dahlia did it. I only helped at the birthing ceremony to bring God out of Alessa. The newly born God wailed once and was dead. It was more of a Satan, but come on. 
all from that girl's and probably Alessa's conscious resistance. And my fucking rifle, you fucking cheaters. Nobody's mentioning me here. That's not the end. After God has vanished, had vanished in a glow of light, Alessa reappeared and gave me a baby. She looked a lot like that girl so long ago. And then Alessa was gone. Dead. There was nothing I could have done to help. I simply clutched the baby to my chest and ran off. The whole thing felt like a dream, but I had proof that it, proof that it wasn't. The girl was nowhere to be found, and in my arms, the baby. Now 17 years have passed. It feels like only yesterday, and again it feels like a million years ago. I confess I had reservations at first about raising that baby. Could I love her? Her existence was thoroughly unexplainable. I thought she could be that young woman who snatched away my beloved daughter. That led to sadness, anger. There were times when I put my hands around her tiny little throat. God, that's so graphic. Several times I even considered abandoning, abandoning, abandoning her. That's what a terrible person I am. But I decided to raise her after all. I just couldn't seem to let her go. When she, when you look at me, you laugh so... Even now I can't forget about that girl. I guess he forgot what he was about to say. But I love you. I have no doubts about that. That's all I ask you to believe. To my precious daughter, Harry Mason. No, wait. Harry Mason is you, the dad. Heather Mason is the daughter. Oh, Harry, doing drugs even before you're dead. But yeah, that's the uh, that's the notebook uh, he left her, and uh, it points out it it proves that the canon canonical ending to the first game is the one that we got in the stream, which is uh, do everything like save Sybil and uh, do the Kaufman side quest, and that will that changes the intro of the game later. So. When you start the game, instead of Harry and his wife finding the baby, it's going to be Harry and Sybil. And, uh, and that leads to Silent Hill 3. That's got to be a coincidence. But still, that's pretty weird. Who could have done this? I don't know, maybe the people who have been following and stalking you and being all sect-alike, you know? Just, just a guess. Just my guess. Shave completed. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, that's all from me for tonight. It's woo, it's midnight already. It's been a little longer, but uh, session, but I don't mind. It's been really fun. Uh, tomorrow morning, uh, we're gonna do early morning. Uh, just uh, awaiting a, a, a reply from Scarlet. Should do Gears of War two continuation. So in about nine and a half hours from now, and then in the evening again with Zombie and the gang, we're doing uh, Resident Evil Outbreak File two. Mark Wilkins Story Mode Part 3. Poor Mark. He got three parts. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for the follows. Thank you, Zombie, Gavin, John. I know you're sleeping. Uh, Skylands, thanks for uh, thanks for joining the crew. Uh, I don't know what else to say. This has been a really, really entertaining session. You guys have a wonderful morning, day, or evening. See you soon. Bye-bye.